hey what up decisive marketers when it comes to marketing all of us would need two things one is the copy and the other one is the creative so creatives we also you know um divide them into images as well as videos right so um uh, you know a lot of times people say that oh video works better and i do agree with them but a lot of times um static images re work really well as well and um we also need them in many situations uh, when they talk about uh, static images and that's what I'm really excited to be talking about today uh, because I'm going to be talking about a graphic design tool and this tool is actually um, very interesting at its core it's not much different from uh, a lot of graphic design tool that's out there um, because they pretty much do the same thing right but this tool has a very very interesting feature and um and and it's it's pretty amazing i i mean i got to show you what it does later on but basically with a click on a off a button it's literally a magical button where you click on it a brand new design appears and it's really um exciting i i want to share that with you um shortly right and today's two is called pick maker but before we dive in be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e-commerce content so here we are in pick maker right so uh ver um just like a lot of um different other graphic design tools that's already out there we talk about canva crello um there has been uh, pixel light a bunch of uh, different other uh, graphic design tools they all have you know like a canvas where you can pick and choose what you want to be creating right you know twitter header whatever just click on it and you can create something um, out of it already right a lot of um, cool stuff right here so um, what i've done is you know click on uh okay i'm just going to try i'm really ex uh, interested about this one zoom virtual background that seems interesting and youtube end card let's try that as well and then um, there's a twitch banner let's click on that as well and it's really really exciting i'm going <laughs> to show you what it does later on um, let's see if we have anything else so that's all right so this oh there's a resume as well um okay let's look at this one right here um this is the twitch banner right and all you need to do is to pick this one let's say you just pick any design that they have right here they've got five templates right here right and let's just take a look at you know the, they got five different templates in here they've got um photos in here and uh you know pretty much a, a stock photo library that you can just insert in here right let's see what's top exclusive i think this are premium um premium photos okay and then you got objects okay some text and backgrounds as well and of course you can upload your own images and you can also import pictures from Pexels, Pixabay, Google Drive and Dropbox which uh, of course these two are coming soon okay so in the okay so these are pretty much the same kind of uh, uh, features right where you can you know set where the item it's going to go into you can lock the layer so that it doesn't change um, you can delete duplicate them you can set the transparency um, okay let's see anything else okay effects so you can put some like shadow um, and stuff like that in here as well so pretty simple stuff um, but I'm going to show you that amazing button right here, which is right here. <laughs> there's two things here. Okay, so uh, there's a three three buttons right here that you can just click and um, instantly generate different designs. So um, the first one is 
MAD all right so um, they call it MAD just because this is a crazy little button let me just show you I'm gonna click on it right one two three and there we go we got a brand new design just like that right really amazing and uh, you can change the fonts as well so this MAD button all right I'm gonna click on it again and again and again and again and again right so you get generally the 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 main idea of it but um uh right so it, it basically kind of randomizes your colors uh font types as well right you can see okay and then you can just do the fonts as well so this button just switches the fonts okay it just switches the fonts around okay and this one changes the colors so right it just changes different colors for you pretty amazing feature from pickmaker i i feel like you know that i want to um be using this way more than i i thought i would want to um because um i when i was supposed to review this i thought oh it's another um graphic design tool which pre is pretty much the same as everyone out there um but with this mad button it changes everything right it changes everything so let's say i were to choose this one okay and then i can hit oh there is actually it also also allows me to change the images right let's try that later on so this is for the fonts okay so i can change the fonts change the colors okay only this one changes because i think the one at the back is a image okay so i can just change the image so different templates, I guess they show different MAD buttons as well. Okay, so it's just it's just changing the uh, the images that's at the back. Okay, but it seems like the the image is upside down right here. Let's try a different template here. Okay, so let's try this. So it keeps everything um, where it's supposed to be it just changes some of the stuff right so so everything about you know pickmaker i think it's it's really about this powerful um mad button right here which is the main selling point of pickmaker i feel um what is this again let me see i think this oh this is the zoom background so Okay, so it's just a blurry so it's just something blurry here I think it's not meant to be blurry it's just um, gotta wait a while for the picture to look correctly maybe some of the images are blur okay I think it is supposed to be a little bit blurry if I'm not wrong right okay okay it's 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 fine now takes a while for it to load um, fully right because it's loading like a full HD image right here so this is the zoom background because it's just an image so there's nothing uh, there's no MAD button right here okay I think this one is you know the most fun one right we can try a different template right here let's try this and let's click on the MAD button
okay so this is looks interesting right and i think it looks cool because i think somewhat it recognizes the the words right here and suggests to you certain stock photos that are within the the particular um niche itself right so you see it's giving the playstation um image right here so that's interesting Not really sure what this one is. Um, let's see if there's anything else. Maybe we can pick some of this as well. Let's try posters. I think this should be the resume. Because there's no templates in here. So I think the resume templates are not out yet. So this one is the poster. So we can change the colors. Let's see what happens. Well, well, this, I mean, don't you think that this looks good? Okay, this is not so... Right, I think, you know, it... It just helps you to create so many different um, iterations just by clicking on this. Right. And then let's try the... Images... Okay, so it doesn't work. Let's try this. Okay, it doesn't work as well. So it, because it recognizes that it is somewhat cut out from the original. So they don't allow you to replace the entire image. So you can only change the colors and the fonts for this. Okay, but you can easily create multiple different um, design just by clicking on this. Can you see that? Alright, let's try this. Okay, so <laughs> this one doesn't work, right? Okay, so let's undo that. Because this is a uh, illustration, so um, I think the image will not work. But try let's try changing the fonts. So it's like you have no ideas, you're not a creative person. But you can be a button masher. <laughs> you can be a button masher to just create. This one looks nice. To create what you like. Okay. Right, it looks great, right? I mean, this MAB thing is just so addictive. Like, you can just click, keep clicking on it. Okay. Um, let's try the Instagram story see what we get this looks good I mean this looks fine it looks fine so let's say I don't like this color, let's try try a different font. It's like you don't have to design anymore but just choose a template, a nice looking template, and just hit the M MIDI button. <laughs> okay, it's taking a while here. This this is just this is just really um really nice to play with. Um I I see that a lot of people um are not picking up Pickmaker right now, but I think after this a lot of people are gonna try it. Because it's so amazing with the MAD button. Right, so um, we've tried quite a few here um, so far. Uh, let's try one more because 
It looks so nice. How to start a YouTube channel. This feels like a book. You know. It looks good. Let's try changing the colors. This this just blows my mind, right? I mean, it adds like gradient and and you know just changing the color and everything. Um, it's just amazing. Let's try changing the fonts first. See what we get. Okay, I think the original uh, font is of course the best, best looking one. We just gotta change the colors, right? Because it, it does give like very good color ideas. So anyway, that's I think that's more or less <laughs> about um, Pick Maker, right? It's all about I I think it's all about the M A D button. Um, it can it can do everything. I mean, it can do most of what your popular graphic design tool that's on the cloud just like canva crello um of course i don't see um i don't see um um anything else that that it is lacking um other than that i think i think that that it you know you just need to throw in a template and have Pickmaker, you know, design everything for you. Um, I think, however, one of the downside would be it seems like they don't have a background remover, right? I think they might not have a background remover yet, but otherwise, you know, Pickmaker seems great. I think it's amazing. Um, you have, you you do have to pay for the elite images. Um, yep. So you got you still got to pay for the elite images for for the elite um, stock images. So um, you only have access to the premium. Um, for the plan that that you get right otherwise i think pickmaker is awesome um it's really fun to use it it seems like you need something designed and and you just have nothing in your mind as to go as to how to go about creating something just go to pickmaker and hit the mad button until you get something like right so that's all i have to say about pickmaker i think that the mad button is really really amazing um and uh, i think that's all i have to say um let me know what you think about pickmaker in the comments below um, if you have enjoyed this video uh, do give me a thumbs up and if you know anyone who could benefit from a graphic design tool especially for someone who has no idea how to design at all and or, or have no creativity at all right tell them all about the MAD make uh, MAD button and share this video with them right and I'll see you in my next video